Welcome back to my daily report market analysis videos with me, Richard Fairmarket Market Analyst at Handtech on Wednesday, the 26th of February. Looking at Dolly Yen, where you know, I find Dolly Yen is an incredibly difficult shout actually at the moment. Which way it's going to be moving is, is difficult because we saw this significant yen weakening last week um, as the market really did start to worry about the implications of um, on uh, growth from the coronavirus in China um, and the implications on Japan. However, there's been a significant unwinding of that move in the last three sessions. So you've seen this spike higher, spike lower. The market is basically back to where it was, I suppose it is above uh, 110.30, so a marginal positive bias still. But generally speaking, I think you could still say that the, the market is not really um, moving in any significant direction, um, given the fact that it has unwound that breakout. Um, still, as I said, still above the breakout of 10.30. But um, is this a, a, a corrective move that's still in process? Well, you'd look at the hourly chart and you'd still say, well, lower highs, lower lows forming. Momentum indicators still negatively configured or correctively configured, I should say. A um, little bit sign of a, of a positive divergence on RSI on the hourly, but nothing decisive really to go on. And the fact that the stochastics have again crossed back lower is a little bit of a concern as, as this recovery um, just falters again around that sort of 1060 mark. But I'd say that um, you need to probably still see um, how uh, the coronavirus um, and COVID-19 really develops and um, the significant market fear because it's, it is the driver um, behind, um, behind Dolly N and, um, or to behind broad markets, I should say. And um, basically Dolly N is a comp, um, sort of is a, a an FX pair of two safe haven currencies, so it's it should be a little bit more dollar balanced by the fact that the market is um, sort of trading above 110, 110.30. But ultimately, it's a difficult call, and I'd be uh, I'd be sort of reticent to take much of a view on dolly and given the fact that it's spiked higher, spiked back lower again um, on recent trading sessions. So it's, it is a difficult call at the moment. We're, momentum indicator is still positively configured. You'd say RSI above 50 is a positive configuration. MACD lines uh, just threatening to cross lower, but stochastics falling away is a negative. So mixed outlook there through momentum indicators, but it is a difficult call at the moment on Dolly N. But um, support levels, if you see the market falling underneath 109.70, which was the the last key breakout, I think that that really does start to see the market turning a bit more corrective. Below 10, I mean, again, I say at 109.25, which was a pivot line uh, earlier on in February, that would be a confirmation of the market turning corrective again. But yeah, just bordering positive bias, but nothing really decisive. So I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos and go to our website to sign up for our webinars.